there, everyone. This is Rao Kao, and let me ask you a question. Do you, Dengeki? Unfortunately, I do. <laughs> Dengeki Mao visits Mega Man Powered Up once again, the second Dengeki Mao challenge. All right, the core gimmick of the stage is to shoot the heads of the pendulum. Oh boy. And adjust their speed. If you do it well, you should be able to clear the stage pretty easily. Overall, the level of difficulty might be a little low. I don't know, man. Stupid hammers. They're like the one thing in this game that just don't feel right. Like, just the hammer. I don't know. There's something about standing on it. I don't know if the engine isn't able to handle the speed that they move at or like the various angles of, 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 of flame that they offer. I don't know, but that's the hammer. There I did press the jump button in time. And that's why I got carried off in Lime. It's how they call hospitals in the Mega Man world. How did that happen? What happened is I interacted with the hammer. <laughs> Hammers are so bad. Uh, it is fascinating. But I can't like stop you. I got nothing. All right, I'm just a little... I don't know how you do this part. You can like swift. Like I, I. Steam. I literally just updated Steam. So why are you asking me to update Steam? Well, whatever. I'll do that later. Yeah. I. How does this work? Like, I don't get it! I, like, I don't understand what you're asking of me here. Ready? How does that jump become possible? For a whole, like... Yeah, like, I can't jump from there and make it in time. Wait, can I slow it down? Oh! Why did I think you could not interact with hammers once they were swinging? Alright, well, okay. Turns out the Tex was trying to help me by saying, Hey, the level is about hitting the hammer and controlling momentum or whatever. They were not lying. Okay, and yeah, there. While still not comfortable, it's going to be physically possible. Okay, alright, so, my mistake, it's fine, it's okay, bullet in the face, it happens, alright, yeah, all this mess, big ol' mess, welcome to the mess. Oh boy, I mean, that guy lost his pants, this is always gonna be a heart? I am very confused about party balls and what they mean to the society around us. Whoa, whoa, alright. Oh yeah, you can't fight this there. I don't know why I was trying. Alright, I'm somewhere. Alright, bullets and pendulums. Alright, what am I... Alright, that's just a big jump randomly. Got it. Alright, okay. Well, alright. Whoa, that are guys! having a bad time, and so did I, landing on this shuriken of some kind. Uh, you know what? It's fine, though. We're making progress. This death is fine because it does not matter. Oh, Jesus, hell. <laughs> like, at some point. Oh, boy. All right. Hey, welcome. I'm trying to press the jump button, but... You, I like, I don't know what is the amount of time you have to press. Uh, whoa, that's where the spike is. Why did I, I? I don't know. I think I just never noticed this one scene because you just kind of fly through it, right? Ah, uh, 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 dude. So here you get to try to deal with the spike's incredulous hitbox. Like, I need to not land too close, but close enough that when I jump, I can go on the other side far enough while fighting a really strong conveyor. Like, this does feel just kinda... yeah, it's... Oh! 
And then when I jumped there, I bumped my head on the pendulum because I was, you know, holding a left very hard to make sure that I clear the spike. This is a... Uh, uh, what am I doing? I don't know. Okay. Alright, I think it wants me to give it a little push. I can jump to this ladder. There we go. We're in ladder town. Alright, hey, buddies. Whoa, you guys are pretty strong there. You know, just, whoa, punching the air like that. Unbelievable. Alright, Diggle. There we go. Let's just go ahead and get that. All the prizes in this little pit. This guy is having a real bad time. And so am I. Well, look at that. My bad time is limited to strict little areas. Alright, big boxes. But there might be something we want on the other side. But if we decide to do that, we're kind of stuck on this path. So, I don't know which path is preferred here. Why would I swing you around? Alright, yeah, like, as much as a level is ostensibly about making the pendulum swing, there's a ceiling there. Over the other ones, I didn't bop my head, but over that pit, though, forget about it. What sounded like a seal in there? Probably the Yashishi, right? So what's up here, then? Oh, oh man, so here's an alternate path, perhaps, here, I uh, okay, that I like a lot less. Alright, well, I don't know, conveyor, yeah, see, this conveyor's a lot lower, and that's where I bought my head on. Ah, oh, man, Kelly is here. Kelly's from Mega Man 2. She, no, 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 I think I know where this is gonna lead. Uh, remember when we saw a corridor underneath, like, the main level? Yeah, I think it's gonna be here. Uh, there's Pants Man. Yeah, there's a midpoint. And there's gonna be a heart on the other side. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at that. I can observe! I notice things! Stereotypes are not always true. Alright, buddy. You got something I want? No. Alright, good. Alright, big eye. I'm just, I'm just not. Oh, jeez. Big... Big something. I just big eye. It's not worth the fight. Except I might have to. Uh, can you die, please, big eye? Is it too much to ask for your demise? Uh, what if I hang out on this hammer and swing like that? It did work. Look at that. You even rewarded me for this. Perfect. Big jump. That was an uncomfortable jump, and we are right at the end. Uh, so there's no hearts here, so I do have whatever amount of lives I drag around with me to fight Time Man for... What's that, the third time in a row? <laughs> Everyone just decide, you know what? Eh, we should fight Time Man. I mean, in a sense, I kind of get it, you know? Like, remember, Mega Man powered up, we got the two new guys, Time Man and Oil Man. And I think Time Man is just funner to fight than Oil Man. Well, Oil Man's a lot more dynamic. Well, I don't know. Like, I just, I feel like... There's a trick to dodging your stuff, and I don't know what it is. What? Whoa, two small ones? You can't do that. No, 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 you're supposed to be moving! You fool! Yeah, uh, you're gonna win this one. If I had all my health going in, time man. Oh yeah, like, you just kinda walled me in. But I mean, I'm kinda, I kinda let myself get walled in. Like, I just kinda stood, I just kinda sit there, you know? But, I just think that in general, it's kind of the way to go with this guy. Alright. Okay, so, here we go. So I'm just kinda sitting there. And he comes at me. When he shoots two love bullets like that. If I hit by the first one, I kinda just go and tank to the bottom. This one, it's pretty great. Well, there it didn't work out because you left. So really, you gotta leap all the time, time man. I just kinda took that hit. Then he's gonna run into me. Yeah, my fireman strategy leaves to be desired, I think. But it's the most consistent way I found of fighting time man, surprisingly enough. Like, just sit there and shoot. If you have full health, you will win if you're in normal mode. Is it sad? Only the fact that I seem to rely on it, really. But I just, I don't know, like, otherwise I just feel I'm not as consistent finding him, so like, what do I do, right?